You've got to get your car running before you can learn how to drive it. Oh my god, stop. Let's stop here. Pull over, pull over, pull over. Pull over. Car Come on. Garage. Yeah, yeah. Anymore, We're gonna find you stuff. We're gonna find you clothes. I'm gonna, gonna dress you up. Oh. Come on! Around. I'm gonna dress you up. Come on. Come on, pull over. Pull over. Oh. Do it. Okay, don't do it. Do that. Oh, come on. It's All gonna right. be fun. Calm down. Yeah. Now it's said that healthy people love themselves. Uh -uh. Oh, this is awesome! I would say that that is really a misunderstanding of the whole thing. I love this so because much. Because yourself is something that is really impossible to love. There are various reasons for this. But one obvious reason is that loving oneself is as difficult as kissing your own lips. Oneself, when you try to focus on it, to love it or to know it, is oddly elusive. It always slips away like uh, the pursued tail of a dog who is trying to get hold of his own tail. So to pursue your own end has some difficulties about it. <clears throat> If you explore what you love when you say you love yourself, you will make the startling discovery that everything you love is something which you thought was other than yourself. And so you begin to realize that if your collective ego or yourself depends on your being on the in, but you can only be on the in with relation to something that is out. And since the in and the out are inseparable, if there is to be any in or any out, you suddenly discover that yourself is bigger than you thought it was. It uh, includes the other, and you can't do without it.